Hi all, let's have another in a five minute chess nutshell game. This is Masinski against Wilfred Henry Pratton, not Pratt, Pratton, played in Portsmouth 1948. Let's have a look. E4, Pratton plays E5. We enter into a Gyoko piano. C3, Queen E7. White castles d6, d4. The bishop drops back. b4, bishop g4. This looks like a nice pin and pressure on the center. a4, threatening to trap the bishop now with a5. Black reacts to stop that. b5, pushing the knight back. And now bishop a3. It looks as though white's got a dangerous position already because of d takes e5 being threatened. Black tries to reinforce the e5 pawn with f6 of course he's weakening this diagonal a bit rook a2 we see knight e6 d takes e5 f takes and now breaking the pin queen d5 that pin there and threatening knight takes e5 is that so black decides to give up the light square bishop and hopefully Maybe expecting g takes, but white plays the better move. Queen takes b7. Yeah, if g takes, then knight f4 is winning for black because of this kind of thing check and then checkmate. So after bishop takes f3, queen takes b7. Now it's a bit different. Black actually played instead of moving the rook, played queen g5. Uh, if he moves the rook, let's have a quick look actually. If he moves the rook, then here knight f4 isn't so critical. King h1, and there's always like a rook g1 defense. So it isn't mating there. Okay, so queen g5 here instead of moving the rook is interesting. The rook's taken with check, king e7, g3. Of course, the mate has to be parried. Now, knight f4, threatening another mate, knight h3, checkmate. An evacuation square is given. And now, queen h5, this is a little bit controversial, in fact. This move, it's a difficult position actually for black, technically. White played knight d2, missing a big chance. To expose the black king. His chance was bishop takes d6, and it seems black's in big trouble here. For example, c takes check, and taking here this bishop is very, very good for white, for example, like this. It's a disaster actually for black. So it would have been very, very big trouble on bishop takes d6. King takes doesn't help at all because of rook d d2 check that's swinging in. And then queen d8 is checkmate as an example. So yeah, knight d2, black's given another moment to breathe and uses this wisely. He plays actually knight f6 offering this rook. That's actually taken. And can you see what black plays in this position? If I give you five seconds, starting from now, an amazing move and combination. <laughs> okay, queen takes h2 check. Very, very forcing move. If king f1, then queen h1 is, or queen g2 is checkmate. So it's taken. Knight g4 check, king g1. And now there's a choice of moves to finish white off quickly. Black chose knight h3 check. Also, bishop takes f2 is much the same actually but knight h3 check and the point is after king f1 black has knight h2 check mate all the escape squares are covered hope you got something from this game quite interesting uh, technically from the point of view of forcing moves and how black was also in danger there as well comments questions likes appreciated Thanks very much.